today we're back as Ben 10 turning into Ben 10 aliens. In the last episode, we were able to unlock Wrath, my personal favorite alien. Uh, I'm pretty sure this dude could do a belly flop. Yep, he can. Let's use Accelerate in order to get to the fortune teller. In the last episode, we were told to go here to figure out exactly what Hex is up to. For those of you guys that have missed out on the series, Hex has basically taken over the entire uh, region of Europe. He's collecting these different stones. They're almost like infinity stones, and right now he has three out of four of them. If he gets the last one, we have no idea what's going to happen, but there's no way it's going to be good. So hopefully this fortune lady is able to tell us a little bit of information. What's up, fortune lady? How you doing today? You looking beautiful as that? Why, hello there. How, wait, how did she know I was coming? Uh, cool. I'm looking for answers. Aren't we all? All right. I guess. There's this evil magician Hex, and he's up to something horrible that's causing chaos all over Strudelbeck. I need to know where he's hiding so I can stop him. Ah, yes. I see. The universe has sent a message for you. Okie dokie. Follow the path of fire to the mouth with no tongue. There is what you seek. The mouth with no tongue. Well, what the flip does that mean? Comment down below if you guys know. Huh? What does that mean? That is for you to discover. I am a messenger for the universe. Uh -huh. no. Not a translator. Hmm. All right. Well, that was kind of helpful, I guess. I'm not entirely sure why this lazy uh, lady couldn't tell me. Oh, all right, all right Gwen, I'm answering the phone. Maybe Gwen will know. Hey, Ben. Learn anything new about our spooky sorcerer? Maybe. A fortune teller gave me this strange riddle. She said, follow the path of fire to the mouth with no tongue. Any ideas? Wait, maybe it's a volcano. All right, I was completely wrong. It's not a volcano. Why would there be a volcano here? What am I thinking? Bye, Gwen. See you later. Well, let's go see if we can maybe track down the area that Gwen is talking about. But first things first, I hey, see a totem. This is definitely a job for Wrath. What's up, big beefster? Wait, this dude looks like he's made out of diamonds. And I don't know if you guys know this, but there's still one alien that we have left to unlock in this series. And that is Diamond Head. Get out of here, yo, big beefcake. Bird, 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 bird. Bird is not the word today. Please, bird. Stop flying around. I just want to be a tiger. I'm going to swatch you out of the air with my claws. Why are you doing this? Stop flying away, please. Oh, hello. I see you want to fight. Boom. Oh, this dude's way too slow. I have cat-like reflexes and also the giant body of a tiger. I will headbutt you and also body slam you to death. That boy dead. Is that all of them? Wait, there's two more up here. Hi-ya! Whoa! Belly flop! Ding, dang, doon. Your mom is dead. I don't know why I said your mom's dead. You're dead. I don't even know if these things have moms. I'm pretty sure Hex might be their mother. Let's see if this was worth it. We got a luck bar. I wanted upgrades. I am very angry. Wait, I see a couple torches here. Ooh, this is perfect. Let's morph back into Wrath. She'll be able to yeet ourselves all the way up here. Is this the right way? I really hope this is the right way. I see a lot of torches, so this has to be the path, and then eventually we need to find the opening, which will be the mouth. Where do these things come from? Not a problem for the big tiger! <laughs> die, die, die. <laughs> They're so slow! Come on, belly pop, baby! Yes! Yes! Come on! <laughs> these things might be made out of diamonds, but they do not stand a chance against rat. That's right. That's why you don't mess with the kitty. You'll get the claws. We got a little guy down here. Fine, little guy. I just bit your face off. What you got going on, pal? No, no, no. Too slow. Okay, no. Oh, hey, 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 hey. That was not cool. I'm gonna have to end your life now there, pal. Man, it is so much fun being rat. I am so powerful. And the belly flops are super effective. Too slow. That's right, bro. Now you're dead. I think I might need to turn into wrath here. Oh, okay. We're gonna do a loop deep loop. And then this way, this way, this way, up this way, up this way. It looks like there's a crystal up here. Maybe if I morph into heat blast, I can just fly over here and we can unlock the crystal. We did it! Anything else up here? Not really, but we can at least see where the next place is that we have to go. It looks like it's all the way down here. All right, it looks like this is a job for Wrath. Oh, I just nailed it! Let's go left, left, down on the bridge. It looks like I need to jump across here. Whoever was here recently definitely did not want anybody following them. All right, Wrath, calm down. Let's try to sniff out any enemies. So far, I don't sniff anything. What is that? 
You smell cookies? All right, if there's cookies in this direction, we definitely need to continue forward. Oh boy, okay, that is a long way down. Looks like we can actually swing over here. Swing, swank, swoonk. All the way over to the rock climbing wall. Rock climb, jump. Lift, lift, lift. Swinger, dinger. Hit it with the binger. All the way over to the rock climbing. Pop our way up here. Jump across. We are extremely talented and also super strong. I did, however, skip leg day, it seems. My arms are massive, but my legs are kind of lacking. Wait, I think this might be it, guys. Look, if I had to guess, Yes, this is the mouth of fire. Okay, let's just try to slowly go down. I have no idea what we're getting into here. If you guys haven't already, be sure to tap the like button. If you do the next three seconds, wrath will roar. Oh, thank you very much. Looks like it actually worked. Wait, I just realized too, wrath gets really, really red whenever he roars. It might be some sort of power-up ability. Where did they come from? I swear they just appear out of thin air. We're gonna slap every single one of you to death. I'm gonna eat you guys for lunch. I haven't eaten all day. Belly slam! This is definitely a job for Raph. Belly flop! Oh, I was really hoping I could belly flop from the top rows, but that did not work as planned. That's all right. That little tiny beefy dude is now beefy dead. Another bridge is out. Whoever was here wanted no parts of anybody following them. Uh, luckily, Raph is extremely talented in the art of rock climbing and also other American Ninja Warrior activities, such as flipping from pole to pole. What is this? We have to get all the way up there? Luckily, I'm not super worried. It's a good thing that we have master control over our Omnitrix. If we did it and it turned into random aliens every time or just continued to time out, we would have a problem. Okay, luckily we could swap to Heat Blast so we can beep bop our way all the way up here to the top. Is this it? Wait, this has to be it, right? That means we have to be close to figuring out exactly what's inside of here. This could be Hex's hideout, ladies and gentlemen, so we should have stick until the end of the video to see exactly what we can find. Of course! You make me so angry! Belly flop! <laughs> slap, 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 flippity slap, 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 big punch, big slap. Don't even think about touching the kitty. Is there more? Let's get a little sniff. All right, I don't sniff anything else other than farts, but I'm pretty sure that was wrath. Let's go all the way up here. What is this? Okay, let's morph back into heat blast and I should be able to light it on fire. Oh, wait, it looks like there's three different torches that I have to light. The other one looks like it's way over here. Yeah, boy. All right, let's light this one too. And the last one is way over there. I think I might need wrath's abilities in order to rock climb all the way up to the top. Yep, 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 and flip, stick the landing. Light this puppy, and the door has fallen. Wait, what is this? Oh, we found a record, Magician Rock. Okie dokie, let's go ahead and open this secret lever. Something. Wait, we completed the mission, but wait, we just went in a circle. I swear it was here before. I don't know if this helped me at all, unless maybe something else opened. Let's go back to the fortune teller and see if she can actually give us some useful information, because this did not help at all. Looks like there might be an area over here for Accelerate to use my rail climbing ability. Let's test it out. Okay, please stop jumping. There we go. What was that? Oh, I found an energy drink. Nice. I thought that was going to bring me all the way back to the fortune teller, but I guess not. Hey, lady. <laughs> I don't know if I understand. What, what, what? I'm not really picking up what you're putting down there, lady. I think this lady is making stuff up. I don't know about you guys, but everything that's come out of her mouth so far has been has been complete and utter pepperoni sticks. It's it's literally been no nothing. It's been nothing useful. Wait, what? What is spaghetti mountain? I guess we're about to find out. It looks like it's at the top of this. Well, we officially made it to Spaghetti Mountain. Comment down below why you guys think it's called Spaghetti Mountain. I honestly have no clue. We have to do so much parkour to get to the top of this thing, so it better be worth it. Yes, yes, keep doing parkour, Wrath. You're a very, very talented giant much. tiger. Excuse me? I just literally used up so much muscles and strength in order to get up here, and you guys come in out of nowhere trying to kill me. They have to be protecting something, so we have to be on the right track. Don't even think about it. I think I might know why this is called Spaghetti Mountain. It's in entire maze. It seems like some sort of giant worm alien just created tons of different random tunnels. It looks like this is a job for four arms. Let's go load up the yeet! Alright, we did it. What did I just get? I, I found a gem. An outrageous gem. That is not what I wanted! That's fine. Okay, so I came from that way. Let's continue to go up the mountain. I think we need to go up here and do a little bit more of Wrath Parkour. We'll hop on these pogo sticks like a ninja. Do a couple more flippy flips. We're so close to the top. Whoa! What? Where'd this thing come from? Wait, I can climb on it. Yes! Get this thing out of my face! It can't touch me! Belly flop it! Yeah! Die, die, die. Yes, yes, yes! Come on! Keep belly flopping it! Yes! Oh, this is so sick! <laughs> we took it out! I've never seen anything like that before! It was like some mini boss battle! It has to be protecting something super valuable up here! Whoa! We're really high up. I'm normally not afraid of heights, but that made me a little bit woozy. Did we just find a cat? 
on top of Spaghetti Mountain? Why would there be a cat? Wait, 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 wait. Just I don't know if we should go back to her. This is not working. We literally just found a cat on top of Spaghetti Mountain. All right, ladies, this is your last chance. If you tell me to climb a mountain and find another cat, or if you ask me to, to go ahead and, and do 16 million backflips just for no good reason, we're going to have a problem. I sense you may feel some frustration, but I must thank you for finding my lost kitty. I suppose it was my destiny you found, not yours. <laughs> I am going to freak out. Um, the fate of all Strudelbeck is hanging in the balance here. Hmm, yes. I sense the universe has one final message for you. Perhaps it will be of use. I see numbers. Two, three, seven. And a horse of great length. Wait, what? Get your horses. I'll take care of it. Yo, 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 where did these guys come from? Why are they after the fortune teller? She literally hasn't even given me any useful information. This makes no sense. All right, I guess this is gonna have to be a job for Excel right now. Yes! Luckily, we're faster than all of them put together. We can literally run circles around them. I'll make a tornado. Wait, I forgot we can literally do damage when running through them. Oh my goodness. Accelerate, you're an absolute savage. Wait, what is this? Another void rift. This could be the final alien. Guys, this is it. We need to escape the void realm. But I think this should be the last alien that I'm able to unlock. Unless if you guys know of more aliens that I can get in this game, please leave a comment down below if that's the case. But this is one of my all-time favorites, Diamond Head. Let's go! Oh my gosh, we are about to wreck so many creatures. Oh my gosh! My special ability is sick! We also have a projectile ability where we can throw tons of diamonds forward. Let's see what this ability is. So I can hold what? So if there's any surface of diamonds, we can literally just skate. Or wait, we don't even need a surface of diamonds. We can just skate anywhere. Oh, oh, n uh, ne never, never mind. It, uh, it slowly goes down. So we need to be a little bit careful about it. Then my other ability is to create an actual diamond wall. We also do so much damage. I have been waiting so long to get my hands on diamond head. Let's try to use our shield to deflect any projectiles. Wait, that is amazing. Wait, can I project? Oh, oh, wait, they just literally bounce back. Wait, that is going to be super effective. And it actually does damage to them, too. Look at that. It's just going to go right back and damage them. And my projectile does so much damage, too. It looks like it actually locks on to any creature that I'm aiming at. Sorry about this, pal. Your time as an alien alive are over. Your time as a dead alien are just beginning. We did it. We actually unlocked, I think, every single Ben 10 alien in this game. My tie to the universe must have attracted dark energy. Hopefully my fortune was worth your effort. Oh, come on. That fortune was ridiculous. Horse <laughs> of great length. I think I'll just try finding Hex on my own. All right. Well, this lady did nothing for me. Take diamonds to the face. Let's try to use Diamond Head's new ability to just go right across. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. A horse of great length. Astrid was talking about the long horse in. And the number 237... It must be a room number. Really? Because I don't know if I put that together in my head. Well, it's a good thing Ben's way smarter than me. And he's only 10 years old. I wonder what I'd find there. I should ask Marie. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's go ahead and head to the Long Horse Inn and see what Marie has to say about the room number. Maybe that's where we'll find Hex hiding out. Or we'll at least find a clue. 